Hello friends, welcome to Code Crush Coding. In this video, we will cover the data abstraction in Python. So, what is abstraction? So, abstraction is an important aspect of object-oriented programming. Abstraction is used to hide the internal functionality of the function from the users. The users only interact with the basic implementation of the function, but inner working is hidden. So, user is familiar with what function does, but they don't know how it does. So, let's Consider in this way, when we have the function, it does take some arguments. So user is known of the arguments, what he needs to provide and what will be the expected output from the function. But user is not aware how the function is performing the actions depending on the arguments. So let's take example. When we use the TV remote to increase the volume, we don't know how pressing a key increases the volume of the TV. We only know to press the plus button to increase the volume. So we do know by pressing the plus button the volume will be increasing but we don't know how internally this is happening inside the TV remote. So that is the use of data abstraction. We are hiding the implementation details from the user. So that was the real world example. So in Python how we can achieve this data abstraction. So in this video we will only see the data abstraction. We will cover the abstract classes in Python in next video. So in Python, we can perform data hiding by adding the double underscore as a prefix to the attribute which is to be hidden. So whatever data we need to hide, so we can achieve by the providing the double underscore to that particular attribute. So after this, the attribute will not be visible outside the class through the object. So let's see in our demo how we can achieve the data hiding in python so this is my abstraction.python file so let's declare one class let's say demo so in this class i have two attributes or two variables let's say i which has the value one and the second variable i want to hide so i will need to provide the double underscore as prefix and the name of attribute which is j and value as two so these are my two variables inside the class and I will have one method here def show so this is the name of the method show sorry show and the inside this method I will print print value of i and I will have here self dot i so in this way I can access this variable i I will copy this statement and in similar way I will say value of j so value of underscore j and here I need to say the underscore j and I will now come outside this class so proper intention should be given so currently I am outside this class now and here I will create the object of this class let's say object is d d equals to demo and with the help of this object I will call the method show now what will be the output the object will call this method show so here we will get the show and we will get this two statements value of i which is 1 and value of j which will be 2 let's run this code so see we are getting here value of i as 1 and value of j as 2 so now we want to hide this data right j so what does the theory says it says the attribute will not be visible outside of the class through the object. So this attribute which we have provided here double underscore is accessible inside this class demo. It will be accessible inside this class as we have accessed this variable here. But it will be not accessible outside this class. Let me show you that. So when I try to print d dot this is the normal variable i d dot i it will print 1. But when I try to print d dot so see i am not getting here the j variable right so it means it is not accessible outside the class but still i try to access this so i should get an error here so let's run this code what will be the output so first time it will say d dot show then we will get these two statements value of i and value of j second time print d dot i so it will print the value of i which will be one and third statement let's see what is the output for the print statement 
if I try to run this code, see here the output. So we are getting here error which says demo object has no attribute j. So see this attribute j cannot be accessed outside the class, but it will be accessible inside the class which is value of j2. So we are not able to get the third st statement because we are getting here error attribute error. So that was the use of data hiding. So when we want to hide the data and only to be accessible inside the class, we can use the double underscore as a prefix to the attribute which will be then hidden. So that's it in this video. We will cover more on abstract classes in the next video. Thank you for watching.